This is the E-Emotive headset called the Epoch headset. Now, this technology is predominantly used for gaming. And it's, as you can see, it's pretty pricey. It's 300 bucks for the headset. Now, there's a lot of companies working on EEG technology. Um, Emotive isn't the only one. But the opportunity is to take the EEG technology and add it to education. Now, how will the EEG technology work in education? And that's what I want to talk about today. Well, the way it will work is this. One is, as a student studies, and as he does tests and other things, the device, the autonomous learning device, is going to know whether a student is struggling with a specific question or not. So right now, it is up to the teacher to figure out, out of his hundred or so students that he teaches, what students are having trouble with what subject, what specific. And it's a pretty much an impossible task, you know. Um, but in the future, what's going to happen, here's the opportunity, is that we can use a device like this. So the kid would wear it like a headset. Um, and as he does a test, it's going to the, automatically understand and know what the student enjoys, what the student is having trouble with. And now what it's going to do then is it's going to provide and shoot um, education content delivered directly to them to, to help them learn that material. It's going to report to the teacher and say, you know what? You know, this student is having trouble with these things. So it's going to allow the, the teacher to hone in specifically on what the student has trouble with and provide them the guidance and the help they need. You know, this is amazing technology. And, you know, right now it's being used for games. It's being used for commercial. And that's great. But in the future, when we have an autonomous learning platform, that will substitute in places like India and China where we can't get enough. You know, I did a talk today on my students where I talked about, you know, India has over a billion. It has a 50% a 50 illiteracy rate and over a 40% dropout rate. Now, the fact is they will never be able to buy or build enough schools, put in the infrastructure for education and other things for, for education. So. Uh, they just can't. They don't have enough money. They don't have enough teachers. It's just purely impossible. Now, the opportunity is to supplement the education system that they have with an autonomous education system. That, which means is this, is that if you don't have a teacher, you don't have a school, it doesn't matter. You can still get an eighth grade education in math, science, and language arts. It's that simple. And you know what? We add a headset like this to it. And understand, this system doesn't exist now. It's going to take maybe five years. It may take as long as 10 years. Now, ask yourself, what is this system going to cost five years from now, 10 years from now? Is it going to cost $299? No. All right? There's probably going to be a lot of emotive type technology out there. And not only that, would, 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 would government supplement the cost so students can have it? You're right. With, in, a, in, a, in a school room like this, you're going to see basically books go. You're going to see this computer go. You're going to see basically um, so much cost savings because a device like a Nintendo DSLL will replace the book bag, will replace the books, will replace everything. And, and it will become the aid to the teacher, right? If you have a school. Now, if you don't have a school, what it's going to mean is it's going to become the teacher and it's going to report back and it's going to have you'll have live tutor aids and everything else that you can you know that you can link into with your Nintendo DS like device so here you are working on it you can have a tutor at the top looking at you working on it working with you on a one to one basis right or if you don't have the money for that or maybe that's not provided you can have videos Showing you, does it work? No, let's see the next one. I don't understand it, see the next one. Eventually, you're going to understand it. You watch enough videos on solving a specific problem or something, you're going to get it. So, you know, the opportunity for flattening global education is here. There's nothing we don't have that can stop it. And the only ones that are, are stopping it, and the question to ask, does our current education system work? The answer is no. And the only people stopping it are the publishing companies, are, are the folks over the global education complex who 
my ideas, my disruptive ideas, my global game-changing ideas for education is going to basically, as I put here, destroy a $4.2 trillion industry. That's right. And that's my goal. I want to bring that complex down. You know, I am David fighting Goliath. And I need folks to get behind my cause, get behind my vision, join the e-singularity mo movement on Facebook. Just do e-singularity.org. It'll take you right there. And together, we can change the world. We can make education accessible and free to everyone. And we can do it within the next seven years. Thank you. My name is Michael Trout. You know, changing the way education will be played or redefining the way education will be played. Thanks.